Bradus Latianu, coming from Romania, and after a long corporate career, I decided to get an entrepreneurship. And we're a digital marketing company focused on inbound marketing and marketing automation, and lately into the e-commerce marketing automation stuff. The slogan of the company is figures for humans. So that's what we do. I think it looks great and it brings together a bunch of people that are involved in the in the industry and in the marketing automation uh, uh, software and uh, as process itself and I think in the future it will develop into the greater event. Yes, it can lead to a significant customer experience if it's <clears throat> linked to the strategy and the implementation of that strategy because it is a tool that has to be programmed until, until now to do actually the flow and everything else that the customer is actually doing online when interacting with the website. Getting out of irrelevance and the biggest challenge is actually how to adapt the message that it transmits to the behavior of the co uh, consumer on the, on the website. Because as opposed to B2B, consumers are more var varied and um, you have more <coughs> personas and more typologies involved. So basically in the future you need machine learning to, to get that insight in order to be able to present the right content, the right message and the right uh, approach using marketing automation to those consumers. Well, the basics is to <clears throat> identify the people that you're talking to, the personas, and to have a content strategy in place to address those personas. That's the basics. If you don't have those, no matter how good is the content, it's just going outside to no one. <clears throat> the second step once you get this is to adapt the content to those persona and to actually get interactive with them, asking feedbacks, reviews, etc. so you can improve all, all, all the time. The drip campaigns and the emailing, those are the functionality that are the basics of the marketing automations these days. In the future, we'll probably have bots, I don't know, WhatsApp, something, messaging, instant, etc. But that's the future.